Hello, welcome to Simple Kids Crafts for All Ages, and today we will be making a, some special crafts. It's actually going to be like three parts, and we're going to introduce introduce a special guest bec because what holiday's coming up in five days? Thanksgiving! Yep. So, first... We're going to be making thankful pies. Let's get s so let's get started. Okay, so, let's get started. For this activity, you will need sharpies, paper pl any kind of thing to draw with, paper plates, and light and maybe at the end you might need a hole puncher and something to color with. We're going to use colored pencils. Or you can do it a different way with these golden hingy thingies that, that we don't have any of. So we're just using something else. Okay, so let's start. Are you ready to start? Yep. So let's start by, you might want to use something straight for this part. We're going to start by, like, you might want to use like a stencil with straight sides for this part, like a ruler. So, I'm going to start by drawing a big line down the middle. That looks like it cuts it in half. Like that. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then I'm going to flip it over. So the holes through the middle. I'm going to do the same thing here. Now, if you only want your pie to be four pieces or two pieces, that's fine. Uh -huh. but we're going to go ahead and turn it so it looks like an X. Like that? Yeah. And then and here and draw another line through there. If you want to stop at four or two, that is fine. Or you can just make three. Then we're going to flip it over so it looks like an X with a line through the middle. It should look like this. And then... Draw... Yeah. Draw another line through it. Perfect. Okay. There's nothing so perfect. Well, pretty good. <laughs> I made it all right. Yeah, it's fine. Now, okay. Now, so that's basically the foundation of our pie. We're just going to, on the edges, we're going to draw some little, some little lines around the edges just so they meet the lines that you drew just keep doing it so we m I think we're gonna pause it maybe yeah just so they meet the lines like on the crust so okay we'll, so we'll, we'll catch up with that later yep we're uh, gonna, gonna pause. pause the recording okay see ya okay and now we are done with the, that so that part yours should look like a kind of like a white a white pizza with white cheese. <laughs> okay. Now we're going now we're gonna we're going to color it. We're going to skip skip most of this part. Yeah. But so we're using colored pencils to color it. You can just um, use anything like markers, crayons, colored pencils. So yeah. we're just gonna pause it. Wait, not yet, not yet, not yet. So one. So here. Oh. So for the. You can do whipped cream if you want. Like if. I'm just going to draw a little circle in the middle for the whipped cream. Wait, should I? Yeah, I'm going to. 
little circle. Let's draw a little, like, kind of flower in the middle for the whipped cream. It, it kind of looks like a little eyeball. Well, I drew kind of like a flower. And do we color it in? Uh, no, we leave that white. And then you can kind of draw some wavy lines in it, like whipped cream. You don't have to if you don't want to. Just, it doesn't actually look that much like real whipped cream anymore. Uh, okay. And then maybe you can do like a little, another thing around here for extra whipped cream. This is only if you want to. Okay, there. Now, we're going to color it. I'm just going to, before we skip this part, I'm going to use, we're going to use orange and we're going to leave the whipped cream white. Orange and orange. So, these are like sketch artist pencils, uh, but you can use anything to color with. So we're going to skip this. Yep, bye. I'm just, see ya. Bye. We'll see you when the coloring is done. And okay, welcome back. Our pies are colored. And now, the final step. Yours looks pretty delicious. Yep. <laughs> My. Does mine look delicious? Yep. <laughs> Very delicious. Uh, so, so, you see we got the crust and the filling. Now, just for the final touch. They're called thankful pies. So we're going to rut. So in each one of these little triangles, in each one of these triangles, we're going to write something that we're thankful for. Yes. So now let's get started. Um, and we might pause the, skip this part, but. Yeah, so, we're gonna, I think we're just gonna pause it, um, but if you, if you need help spelling anything, I will, if you need help, <gasps> what, if you need help spelling things that you're thankful for, then I'll hold it up later. Hey, um, so we've finished our thankful things. I'm just going to hold my, if you're thankful for some of the same things as me, you needed some, and you needed some help spelling, I'll just hold my pie up to the screen so that you can so that you can have help spelling them if you were thankful and the same things as me. So, how fun was that? We made some thankful pies. Um, and this was not our only craft for the day. We're doing one more. And I'm, and warning, this craft will be adorable. So, we hope you guys stick with us for this next part of the video. We hope you guys had fun making thankful pies if you did them at home. Um, and I think this part of the video has come to an end. So, we're going to be starting our next part of the video right now. So, um, welcome to the next part of our Thanksgiving special. Little raccoon holding a pumpkin behind us. <laughs> so, and we're going to be drawing. Are we going to be drawing in this part? A cute turkey! Yep, cute turkeys! Are you ready to get started? Yep. Let, alright then, let's go! For this project, you're going to need something to draw with and something to color with and also of course uh, mm, parent supervision 
Uh, just kidding. <laughs> well, if you're using Sharpies and you're under the age of five, I would recommend sharp parent supervision. But yes. So, ready to get started? Yep. So first, we're gonna start with the body. Body. So let's draw. Big circle here. Right in the middle, kind of flat. Circle. Like that. Yep. And now, and now we're going to draw the head. Ano another circle. Right about, you can draw it on the top of your turkey if you want. Or right here. Wait. Yeah, we're going to draw... Another circle right here for the head. No, you don't have to. Um, and I'm just gonna draw mine right there. Okay. Now, okay. Next, we're going to do the tail. Okay. Start with a line going up. And then arch mm -hmm. over like a little uh, like a little rainbow with one layer. Yours should look like this. The little guy with the cane. And then I just did that. Then <gasps> that doesn't actually really matter. And go down and come up and arch it again. Like that. Like this. Yep. And then Just this time, I'm going to do this. Except since the turkey's head is in the way, stop there and then draw a little line here. Yes. This one just draw arch. Arch. There. Arch. Arch. And we're going to kind of get. And then here. And that. That. And that. Okay. And then maybe just a little that, that, that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Our turkey's tail is has been drawn. Now, are you ready? Mm hmm We're gonna draw some eyes. Okay. So, wait, we're gonna draw the we're gonna draw the wait, no, now we're gonna draw the wings. Are you ready? Yeah. So, let's see here. Okay, so take your marker and draw a little thing going up right there. I'm just going to do it on the side of my turkey because his head is right there. So, like that. And I'll draw it going in. Like that. And, and then arch. draw another one up here. And then make it go in like that. My you turkey can... isn't exactly isn't very good, so if you want to make another one, there's the wing. That's the wing. Yep, here's some wings. And now I'm gonna draw some eyes. A little circle here. And on here, two little circles. That, that. Then draw some little circles in th in them like that. These. And then we col and then color the rest in like this. So his eyes look like they're sparkling. Mm -hmm. Now. Now, I'm going to come in here, draw a little upside down triangle for the beak. I'll just draw it like this. That's okay. And then some little nostrils. Yeah. And now, I'm going to draw this, uh, the 
You can call it a gobble. I call it a gobble, but what's its real name? Its name is... The real name for it is... The Snood, I think. Yep, we're going to draw the Snood. Come here. Right. And a little thing going down there. And then up. Right like there. that. Yeah. He's looking yeah. like a turkey, isn't he? Yep. But what's he missing? Um, his feet. Yep. So, we're going to draw a line here. Line here. And if you want, you can do little legs like whoop, 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 or just yeah. like. And then another line here. That. And then we're going to put some little toes in. Like a little V. Two. I just do three little toes. Then and then another V, and then, and then connect them with another toe back here. Our turkey is looking awesome, isn't he? Yeah, I just did that. Now, we're going to draw the pilgrim hat. Yes. So, start by drawing a, a, line. a straight line through here. Yes. There. Now, curve it up like that and then stop like right there. It almost looks like a witch's hat. And then connect them with a flat line. Like that. Is that cool? Mm-hmm. Then we're going to draw the buckle on his hat. Like that. Yep. A little line through there. And then... Another line. This time we're going to go up. And we're just going to color it in and with a tiny hole in the middle. I can't really and see then, Okay. Now color the rest. Now we're going to color in the rest of the hat black. I don't have a black marker. Uh, you can use a black colored pencil. Here. And now I'm just going to use a little And then, mm -hmm. so now we're going to color it. I'm going to use some, I'm going to start with the beak. So, there's a little bit of yellow for the beak. And then some, some red for the snood. I already one. colored mine. Hmm. And then, I'm going to use some brown for the rest of his head. Uh, yeah, when I'm done. Oh, you can use this brown. Thanks. Some brown for the rest of his head. I think we might actually kind of fast. I think we might. I think we're going to skip most of the coloring. Now you can color the rest of the body black or brown. What, why do you want to color the rest of the body? Black or brown? I want to color it brown. Okay, I think we're going to skip this part now. And just color the wings black or brown yeah. too. We're, we're going to be back with you in a second. So, now you can see our turkeys are colored. Yay! Um... Maybe I'll I'm, I'll just add a little bit of feathers here. I don't need to. Okay. Okay. Our turkeys are done. How do you feel? Yeah. Pretty good. Do, how right. do you feel? Pretty good. We hope you guys had fun with us. Um, we sure did, didn't we? Yeah. And thank you for. Thank you for uh, uh, okay. Thank you for drawing with us if you drew with us. Don't forget and um gobble, gobble, gobble. and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Bye and cut. Yep. Cut. Sorry, we just we weren't able to do all three parts that we wanted to, and... Mom's not kind. Yep.
uh, the special guest was going to be our mom, but yeah, she isn't really coming. So, we just wanted to let you guys know in our last Thanksgiving video, and we'll be seeing you in our next video. Bye!